Hello everyone, this is Utopia. Today I'm going to do a very quick video on how to mod music into Europa Universalis 4. For this video, I'm going to assume you already know how to set up a basic mod through the Paradox Launcher. The first step is really, really easy. All you need to do is just add a folder and name it Music. Inside this folder, you need to add all of your music tracks that you want to play in the game. Just like this. Now there are four things you need to know about the music tracks that you add to this folder. First of all, they must be in .ogg file format. Secondly, they must be sampled at 44.1 kHz. They must have 32 bits and finally, 192 kilobit per second frequency. If your music files have parameters that are different to this, you may experience oddities and strange noises within your music, or it may not even play within the game. So now that you have your music tracks within the folder, you need to add two files to the folder. One will be a .asset file, and the other one will be a text file. Open your text editor of choice and start typing the following code for each track of music. Music in an open bracket. Name equals, and then in inverted quotation marks, enter the name of your track as you want it to appear in the game. And then on the second line, add file equals, and then in inverted quote marks, add the file name of the song that you want played, then close it with a bracket. Once you have done this, save the file as a .asset file. You can give it any name you like as long as it does not conflict with any existing file names within the game or another mod. Be sure that it is not a text file as sometimes your computer can be sneaky. Now create a second file, and in this one you will define each song and the chance that it has to play. For each song you'll need a couple of basics, song in open bracket, and then name, and the name needs to be exactly equal to what you wrote in the asset file under name. If you get this wrong, you may end up with empty tracks appearing in the music player in Europa Universalis 4. Then we can begin modifying the chance that the song has to play. So we start with chance and then modifier and factor equals 1. Most vanilla tracks have a factor of around 1 to begin with, so always start with this number. Save this file with any name you like, it doesn't matter as long as it does not conflict and make sure that this one is a text file and not an asset file. Then what you can do is you can add more lines of modifiers and factors that will change the chance of the song to play. Now these factors are multiplied together when the conditions are met, so you can do anything you like to change how likely a song is to play. For example, factor equals 2 and then is at war yes. And what this will do is that when your country is at war, the song will have twice the chance to play. One really handy trick is to use factor equals zero. So in this case, what this would do is that when you are at war, this track will not play. It will reduce the chance to zero. So then also what you could do, you could write tag equals ter, so the Ottomans, and then if you put knots around it, then the track will only play when you are the Ottomans, and it will not play if you are any other tag within the game. So that's pretty much all you need to do to add music to the game. Let's jump into the game and see if it works. So here we are in the game as the fine nation of Albania, and you can see all the way down here at the bottom of the music list, our track has been added and it has a length and if we click on it, it plays. 
Now if I use the next song function to test the functionality, you can see that the track never plays. However, if I now tag switch to the Ottomans and hit the next song, it plays. So one more quick tip that you'd probably want to know, and that is how to change the loading music within the game. All you need to do is add a new track to your folder or rename an existing one and call it maintheme.ogg and you do not need to add this to the asset file or the text file. We made a music mod. I hope you've learnt a lot. If you'd like to stay for more music, then please subscribe and welcome to Utopia. Otherwise, I'll see you later.